It was five years ago, over five years ago, and it feels like just yesterday, I took a million dollar pay cut so that all of my employees could make at least $70,000 a year. And so I really don't think I should have gotten, in hindsight, as much recognition or as much praise for what I did. I think that really should be a normal thing, and I think we should expect that from our businesses and from our employers. That is Treasure Valley native and CEO of Gravity Payments, Dan Price. Remember, he made big news five years ago in Seattle. In April of 2015, he announced that he was going to pay his staff a minimum wage of $70,000 a year. They were stunned and thrilled, of course. And to help pay for that, he slashed his million dollar salary to $70,000 a year as well. There are 54 people in the company's Boise office. The minimum wage here is 50,000 a year and it only goes up from there. But right now in the middle of COVID-19, business is down 50%. And Dan Price says his employees in Boise came together in an unbelievable way to avoid layoffs. Take a look. Explain what Gravity Payments does for those who don't know about you. Gravity Payments, you know, we serve small and medium sized businesses. And so Gravity Payments uh, reduces the costs and headaches of accepting credit cards. And we've done that for 16 years. We've lost over half of our revenue since the COVID crisis started. Tell me how you are avoiding layoffs here in Boise. So I just laid it out to everybody. I said we lost over half of our revenue. And how are we going to avoid layoffs? They came back to me and said, why don't we just see what every individual on the team can do in terms of working extra hours, in terms of volunteering for a pay cut? And, you know, as a CEO, you think, well, you know, everyone's going to think someone else is going to do it. So I have a lot of confidence in my team, but we'd never been put to a test this big. And sure enough, the employees came through in a way that I can still barely understand. But on an anonymous individual basis, we had 10 employees say that they wanted no pay at all. We had between two and three dozen uh, employees step up and ask individually for more than a 50% pay cut. Excuse me, 98% of our employees asked to take a voluntary anonymous uh, pay cut. And because of that, we went from losing a million and a half dollars a month to now we're losing only a half million dollars a month. And we would have been forced to either do layoffs or increase fees to our small business customers like the rest of our industry is doing or both. I mean, this is striking in this day and age. And in this economy, people are scared, people are frightened, they're worried about their pay. What do you wanna to say to your employees? I wanna say uh, that I'm humbled. I appreciate you. I, I take the responsibility very seriously. Um, I take it on a personal level to try to find some way to pay that forward back to you. So we really think that if we can help our 20,000 small businesses recover, then we'll be okay. For Price, the key is getting the small businesses that work with Gravity to take a leap when it comes to technology, moving businesses to online platforms, because social distancing isn't going away anytime soon. But that technology is what these small businesses need to be able to compete going forward. And so my hope, and this may be way overly optimistic, is that by installing software into those small businesses to help them deal with COVID-19, we can help them to more effectively compete with the Amazons of the world and with all these other online alternatives in the long run. Really by changing business models. Yes, and again, it, it's, it's the type of thing that as consumers are going digital, it'll help these businesses in the long run, even though it's so painful now, and they're able to have a better shot of making it through this horrific storm. And Gravity Payments' goal is to weather this storm without laying anyone off and then getting everyone paid in full again. The state is planning to open all retail stores tomorrow, so that should be a step in the right direction for Gravity Payments and for so many other businesses around our state. But incredible that the employees, 98% of them, voluntarily took a pay cut to save jobs. That's amazing. That is community in action it right is. there.